right, so I just got done doing my run up, and I don't know that this thing is charging. I'm not showing any me needle movement. Uh, let's see here, let's go back up. There's 17, my suction is good. I'm not showing any movement on the, uh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Ah. Uh. All right, well, Bud Sickles. Man, that sucks. But that's why we do run ups, right? Today's mission may be scrubbed. And I'm not getting up there and uh, losing, losing radios. I don't have a backup radio. So, dang it, dang it, dang it. Thirty lands. Hey, ground up, Rickard, forty nine fifty seven. We're pushing off. Uh, 45. Um, is there a place you'd like us to wait for a time? Uh, no. The ramps are controlled and uh, good spots in between. Julia 2 and 3, they're up next to the grass. Alright, thanks. Alright, well. Let's shut her down. All right, avionics coming off. Well, sometimes you need to make a decision and err on the side of caution. And today I did. The amp meter wasn't showing any charge. Um, just the needle sitting dead at zero. And so I made the decision to not fly uh, after getting it back to the hangars and having somebody look at it. I was told that uh, before start that the needle will be below zero a little and then after start that it, uh, it comes up just a little barely above the zero almost non a non noticeable amount and uh, evidently I didn't notice it so uh, and he said if it's if it's not charging you'll see a negative reading because of radios and equipment pulling amperage off the battery um, I didn't know that I just saw that it was at zero so I called it taxied back and uh, lived to fly another day but evidently nothing was wrong with the aircraft at all it was just me being too cautious if there is such a thing in aviation so anyhow we'll go home and uh, enjoy this beautiful day doing something different and fly again next week 
don't know, we'll see what weather looks like tomorrow. Maybe I can call up there and squeeze something in. But between, uh, they were 30 minutes late um, getting there. So I was scheduled from 8 to 10. They didn't get there until 8.30. Um, and on top of that, at about 11 o'clock, the, uh, the winds are going to pick up to, I, I think it was like 10, 11 gusting uh, and whatnot. So by the time I got into a different airplane or got back in my airplane and set everything back up, got back out there, it would by the time I took off, it'd be time to turn around and land again before those winds came in. So uh, again, just wasn't meant to be today. So anyhow, that was my day of flying. I got some taxi time in. Anyhow, we'll do it again sometime else. Later.